hybrid intelligence is about human and machine collaboration. It's about something that lasts, that isn't about control, but a mutual sustainment. My name is Su Guan Chung. I'm an artist and researcher working in the field of human and machine collaboration. I myself am a product of uh, hybridity, you could say. Um, my mother is a computer programmer and uh, my father is an opera singer. Hybridity is really at the center of so much of what I do. I feel like I'm part of a new emerging guard of art practitioners who use code and data as a kind of paintbrush. For me, quite literally, a paintbrush. Seguin is the living representation of what it means to bring the brilliance of a human mind and combine it with technology in order to do something really cool. The relationship between people and technology is so central to Quantum Black. Artificial intelligence specifically plays a role because it allows people to experiment in new ways that previously were impossible to do. And for Seguin, that comes out in the best forms of representation in the art world. At the very beginning of the project, we had to really figure out what it was that we could bring from Quantum Black versus what Sugwen needed in terms of input for, for the art. We've worked with her on different levels from what is the essence of Quantum Black and the products that we make here to helping her think through what type of data she could possibly be using to power the machine learning algorithm that she wanted to use in her artwork. One area that we really shared interest in was this idea of our natural ecology and ways to use data science and AI to find new understanding of the world around us. We realized that the collaboration was going to be, we used Quantum Black's methodologies and we used data that, that related to Su Gwen. So I was thinking about where I grew up and that childhood moment of experiencing nature for the first time, which for me was the sprawling river. I really loved the metaphor of the river and data and how it's always changing, it's always in flux. Our data scientists processed the data from the river and trained our causal next model. Causal next is a package that Quantum Black created. It was used to learn relationships between all of the different variables. It was able to form a network of how oxygen levels, pH levels, the water flow rate, whether it had rained, how these things related to each other. We were then able to pass this trained model onto the artist in a form that she could then query the model herself. I'm further developing that model through um, connecting my EEG, my brainwaves with the data. I've designed a new multi-robotic system that employs my own biofeedback uh, that translates as positional gesture, but also the model data determines the direction of the robotic gesture. So I'm trying to layer this idea of um, the human body and river data on one canvas. Causal Next was the obvious choice for this project because it intrinsically requires both humans and technology to work. It's genuinely hybrid intelligence. When I'm in the space of performance and painting with the robotic units, there is a mutual reliance with these machines that I can't ignore. We become part of this coherent, interconnected system, and that really changed how I think about robotic development. Hybrid intelligence is the combination of the brilliance of the human mind and its problem-solving capabilities, as well as the application of innovative technology in order to address changing and challenging problems. For me, hybridity is about imagination and about balance. And an openness that points to a more creative future moving forward.